what that noise was. It was a basketball. <laughs> so I was dribbling up and we're like, what is that up there? Life with the Currys, that's what's up. The superstar family making a name on and off the basketball court. Stefan becoming the first ever unanimous NBA MVP and his wife Aisha, a star in her own right with her amazing dishes. How do I know? Because I had a chance to visit with them at their home outside of San Francisco to see what's cooking. Aisha here. Food, family, and faith. Aisha Curry's ingredients for living her best life. Welcome to Little Lights of Mine. She's a self-taught food maven whose recipes and lifestyle hacks gained her over 4 million social media followers and frequent appearances on Rachel Ray and Chop Jr. This is phenomenal. At home, her NBA superstar husband, Stefan, and their two daughters, Riley and Ryan, are happy to be her very own taste testers. It's obvious. Aisha, your passion for food, for cooking. Tell us where that all stems from. It stems from family. Mm -hmm. um, growing up, I just remember always being in the kitchen. I feel like food gets people talking and it makes mm -hmm. people feel things and that's why I love it so much. I have about a half a cup of milk here. It was Stefan who one day said, everybody's always asking for your recipes. Why don't you start a blog? And now, she's parlaying that blog into a cookbook, The Seasoned Life. So what do you want somebody picking up the book to get out of it? I want them to know that it's never that serious and it doesn't have to be perfect, but it can be delicious and it can be quick and it can be easy. Let's get cooking. And this fall, she makes her Food Network debut on her new show, Aisha's Homemade. Can you tell us a little bit about the show, what we'll see? I wanted people to have fun with food mm. and feel like they can have company over people in the kitchen and still prepare a meal and even get people involved. And so you'll see bits and pieces of our family and some of our closest friends. Now, despite her hectic culinary schedule, she still manages to make it to 95% of her husband's home games. And she's known for being, well, a passionate, outspoken fan. One of her live tweets landed her in hot water with fans after she called the NBA rigged. You're very passionate. Yeah, and I'm in love with my husband, and so I was protective. It's hard to, to portray your personality in 140 characters. And so mm -hmm. at times I tend to be very cynical, and I don't think that comes across very well mm -hmm. on social media. <laughs> so, What is it like to be a basketball wife, if you will? It's, it's interesting. I, I always say I don't like to call myself a basketball wife. I am... Um, I like to say I'm just a young woman who happened to marry somebody that ended up playing basketball. And for him, I don't think he would identify himself as a basketball player. He's a young man of God placed in a, a great position doing what he loves, playing basketball. Seeing Riley at the press conferences and, st and things like that, how is she handling being? She uh, has no idea. I really want to keep it that way, mm -hmm. but she's sassy. She's got a big, she's a big ball of energy. I got a chance to try some of Aisha's recipes and catch up with the other Chef Curry. So we are doing my spiced rub chicken with parsley mint sauce. It's a it's definitely a household staple. Definitely a household is it a staple. Chef Curry approved dish? Oh, it is. What's it like? You know, she's got the book coming out, the TV show. How is it for you? It's unbelievable because uh, it's, it's her passion. There we go. So what's the game day? When is game day? What's what's burning Ooh. in here? What's game day meal? We game day is always some sort of super carby pasta dish. Ah. Always. Mmm, mmm. Make you smack your mama. <laughs> mm -hmm. Make you want to smack your mama. Mm. Oh, oh Joe's barbecue. <laughs> Curry off a curl, hits a three. After a nearly perfect season, the Golden State Warriors lost a 2016 NBA title to the Cleveland Cavaliers. So, here we are in the cusp of another season. Are you ready? Definitely ready. I'm ready to turn the page and get back to work. Tell us about that one big change, <laughs> KD. <laughs> big, obviously, big addition. We lost some key guys, some, some of my good friends, but you have to be excited about what we could be going forward. We're adding KD and, and our core guys that we have. It's gonna be amazing. It's not gonna be an easy transition, but it's gonna be something we really gotta focus on, but looking forward to it. Oh, oh. The Are day would not be complete without a tour of Riley's brand new playhouse. Oh my God, Riley! Which debuted on the TLC show, Playhouse Masters. So you do your thing. Oh, oh just a slice of life with the curry. 
And Riley is so savvy. You saw when she jumped into the pit like that. She looked in and she goes, why is a camera in here? Like she goes, <laughs> <laughs> she's so aware. They are an adorable, loving, close family. Clearly, yeah. Yes. And so I saw that episode where they delivered her playhouse. Oh. I don't know why I was watching that, but I did see it. But what what really nice people, and you mm -hmm. don't you don't realize you look they look like ba have baby faces on oh TV, my gosh. but when you see them in person, you realize how young they well, are. About 30 years old. Yeah, no. but we have a lot going for them. A lot going, of going. And along, and they handle it extremely well, I think. And the two biggest stars are going to be Riley and, and Ryan. Ryan.